with a 77% field goal percentage last year, and almost every shot was right there at the rim. He's got to really improve on a free throw line. Shot 41% last year. Grimes off the glass and good. On the inside. He's trying to go into it, and they're going into him quite a bit. Look at this. Oh, what a great nice up and fake, under. Huh? Oh, what a great up and under. Oh, he left something on the floor. It hangs over the sport as a whole right now. Well, I think there's some people out there who want to indict everybody because of the actions of a few. Let's face reality. This is the actions of a few. Experience to practice every day against three outstanding perimeter players, two of which are now in the NBA. Off the inbounds. And Bill Self's not going to like that. That is Aaron Henry. This level say that. Well, I'll tell you one thing. The Big Ten's going to be a lot better than it was last year. Only four teams got a turn. Nice backdoor cut. Oh! oh great and as Azabuki meets Henry way up above the rim. But he's found that even taking some of those risks has made him better. Obviously, he's in a rhythm tonight. Lob finish. Loss into Azabuki. Hit the three. And now a turnover. Dotson. Into the chest and the finish. What a nice drive by the freshman. We've been talking about that for years. I've been doing TV 40 years now with the SPN. I'll tell you, every time, every game I talk about moving without the ball. Eventually, Lawson won the battle. Final seconds of the first half. Can they get a shot off? Arms for three. Yeah, that's good for three there. They need a the little yeah. momentum. In. So he plays hard, plays with passion. A little undersized for the four spot has really worked to extend the range. There's a drive and a finish for Lawson. He'd be one of the big impact Marco Polo's transfers. Okay. I, you know Marco Polo's, yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know if There's a drive by McQuaid. Double team by Azubuki and Lawson. He isn't in an open shot yet. Oh, wow. great defense. Kenny Goins with a tremendous rejection. He plays with a lot of tenacity. And it pays off in a three at the other end for Langford. Tudor brought in a whole second five, was frustrated with the way the team was playing, came back out, and Jay Will went bananas, dropping dime after dime. Right, lost four players in the top 33 selections in the NBA draft, but they're still going to be really outstanding again this year. How about Kenny Goins? And the Spartans back within eight. I think I'm thinking, I think something happened here. Whoa, Ward gathers, and then has it knocked away by Lightfoot. Lightfoot with a good defensive play. Nice look. Oh, great look inside. Dots into Lightfoot. Lightfoot, great pass to the interior. Teams do that. They share the basketball in the high percentage of... We're going to win a little push right there. How about a strip by Dotson? Numbers for KU. Nice pass again. And Lawson will finish. The number two ranked incoming freshman. Well, you know, Higgins and Kelton Johnson. You think about Hero, Montgomery. They got some good freshmen. McQuaid with a much-needed three. You know what Kentucky also has? The Veterans. John Cal right. Shevsky and John Calipari both love their teams. They love the kids and Why the togetherness. Why would you love? Right. I mean, who wouldn't love those kids? Come on now. Who wouldn't love having all McDonald's All-Americans? Most coaches wish they could have one. Are you kidding me? Number one, two, and three.